Okay, this is going out to anybody on Thinking with Portals, or anybody who can help me with this thing that I'm doing. Anyway, I've made this level in Hammer, and as you might be able to immediately see, I've used some custom items. As you can see over here, I've got the high energy pellet emitter. Portal 1 doors, if I could just get over there where you can kind of see it. In this room here, we've got the senderficator and the high energy pellet catcher. Now, I downloaded the senderficator and B mod specifically so I could have those items in my map. I've got it all working. I'll just go ahead and compile the map to show you that it works. Okay, so here we are. This is the level that I made. <laughs> Now this is how it should look, as you can see on here everything looks just the way it should do, the doors work, no weird textures anywhere, the looks like it should do. Just to show you that the sendificator and the thing do work, I've just gone and spawned a couple of cubes, so I'll just put this on here. The sendificator does send a forcate. and the high energy pellet does work. So as you can see everything when I play it on my main computer everything is working absolutely perfectly the way it should do. Now I'm sure most of you know Unless I pack all those items into the BSP, other players aren't going to be able to play this level unless they have those files that I downloaded. I tried using Packrat to pack all the items into the BSP and then upload it to the workshop, and the very first comment I got said that a lot of things were missing, even though I used Packrat's auto feature. Okay, so I've now loaded that BSP that I created in Hammer into Packrat, and what I did was I pressed the auto feature, as you can see, it says it's found some items, so let's put them into the pack. If you can read this, I don't know how well you can see it, but you can see that there's lots of senderficator and high energy pellet files there, so it looks as if it's found all the files that it needs. So I'm just going to save it. I'm just going to call it test. Okay, I've now put the file onto my laptop, which doesn't have the senderficator or the um, BMOD stuff installed on it. So you can think of this as somebody else trying to play my map. So let's just load my map. Well, as you can see right away, the doors don't look right. See, there is just absolutely no detail in there whatsoever. And the textures just completely disappear. There's no texture on the uh, thing, as you can see right there. Again, you, well, as you can see, the sendificator also is completely white, along with the high energy pellet catcher. So, what went wrong? I thought Packrat was supposed to put all those files into the thing so it would work. And nothing works. Uh, well, the sendificator doesn't work anyway. I'll just pick this up and put it on there. I'm not used to using a keyboard and a mouse either. I usually have my controller mapped to all the things on this. But, as you can see, it doesn't even do anything. It doesn't do anything! The high energy pellet, though, does kind of work. As you can see, it worked, and it started the lift with the laser, so... Yeah. So anyway, just to show that this graphics thing isn't an issue with my laptop, I've got some of my favourites here in my queue, so... Oh, uh, let's just load this first one right here. Well, you can see things are working. Obviously, I didn't make this one. I'm just trying to demonstrate that the, you know, that it's not a problem with, with my laptop. It's the um, problem with my the file itself. 
Yeah, we can pretty much tell that that's working. Okay, so here we are back on my main computer. And I have tried everything I can think of to make this level work. I've even gone and copied everything that's in the SDK content con folder. Copied everything and put it into the Portal 2 folder. So everything that was in the SDK content folder and the subfolders is now here as well. And then I tried Packrat again to see if this time it would put all the files into the BSP, but still no luck. Also got another map packer thingy program, what you might call it here, called Map Analyst. So let's just load my map into there and let's see what it does. Okay, well, you might be able to see that a lot of stuff here is in blue. It says, for, right, for instance, right here, it says not added models, centrificator, cube, blah. Now, understand that files that it puts in blue are files that are not found. And, well, as you can see, there are a lot of files here that are just not found. So it would seem that there's files missing, yet when I tried to play the level on this computer, as you saw, it worked absolutely fine. So I have absolutely no idea what's going on. There's one little thing I forgot to mention, which I will mention right now. In the Sendificator README, it said I should use these files here to compile the map, except it doesn't work. I've set my Steam directory to, you know, program files x86 Steam, and the game directory. This is all absolutely right. Apparently it's just supposed to go to compile, but I don't think it did it. I don't think it's working. And it disappears before I have any time to read it. The only way I can figure out what it says is to run it, and press the print screen button and just hope that I've taken the screenshot at the right time. Then I can load it into paint so I can actually see what it says. And right there you can see in red it says it couldn't open the map. And now if you look in the maps folder, it's actually deleted it. It's not there anymore. In fact, I'll go and prove that it, that it deletes it. Fortunately, I made a backup of it, which I called the station, so I've just gone and put that in there. So I've gone and changed the build parameters in the thing so I can find the file. So now let's just run it and watch. Watch this as I run the thing. Do you see that? It disappeared. It deleted the file. So I... I'm not even able to compile the map using the thing that was provided with the Sendificator files because, well, as you saw when I try to run it, it just deletes my file and then it says I can't find it. So anyway, that's it I guess, so if anybody knows what I'm doing wrong, then please comment. If anybody knows what I'm doing wrong, either on Thinking With Portals or the attached video on YouTube, so any help you can provide will really gladly be appreciated.